The Kingdom of Bhutan, a small country in the Himalayas, is known for its unique efforts to develop a balanced nation based on the gross national happiness concept. The country aims to do this not only for its socioeconomic development, but also for promotion of conservation of the natural environment and traditional culture. The Gangte Popji area was designated as Bhutan's third and largest Ramsar wetland in 2016. This beautiful place is home to the endangered black neck crane. However, in the wave of the nation's economic development, as well as globalization, there have been several proposals from the outside region to build large hotels, which is placing a growing burden on the local natural environment. As NBS, a local environmental NGO has developed ecotourism as a basis for environmental education. With the cooperation of the national and local governments, the project established a system where the economic benefits of tourism are directly linked to the improvement of livelihoods of local communities by promoting community-based sustainable tourism rather than tourism development by foreign capital. The local environmental NGO collaborated with international partners from various countries like Japan and Austria and developed homestays, trained local guides, developed local souvenir products and eco trails, and set up a community-based tourism management organization to manage these activities, thereby creating a system to properly circulate the economic benefits of tourism within the community. By doing so, residents became aware that the proper conservation of cranes and wetlands had helped them become a tourist resource and improve their livelihoods. And as a result, a virtuous cycle was created in which they voluntarily participated in wetland conservation activities.